welcome back everyone now we are going to learn about something exciting so why i am excited about that because we are again going to learn intrinsic and extrinsic i know you are going to tell me that we have already learned here so why you are repeating the same thing again and again like here we have learned it already so no no this one not this is not my intention to teach you again and again the same thing the intention is something different and exciting the number of holes is equal to number of electrons and number of holes is not equal to number of electrons when you dope it so in the pure form there is a difference in the doped form there is a difference n is a number and the e is electron h is the hole and i already told you that h is the hole means absence of the electron so here something interesting happens so what interesting thing happens here like if we try to calculate the current so what is the current in this case so i is equal to current due to the electron and current due to the hole because in any way the charge is flowing and the flow of the charge is itself known as current so what is the interesting fact here the interesting fact here is this is not the same for the extrinsic one now the things are getting interesting right get excited buddy boring stuff is over now we are going to learn some real science so stick with me and we are going to learn and explore this in the next one take care god bless